Hey everybody. I wanted to take a minute to answer a question that is phrased a lot of different ways by a lot of different people. The basic question is, who's right? Now I get different flavors of that. People say, well, what does it mean to be a true Christian? Or what do you think about that political thing that people are doing? Or what about vegetarianism? Or what about this and that and the other? And I have very strong opinions about all of that. You know me, I can't shut up. But at the end of the day, a lot of times, the deeper question behind the semantics of the question is, who's right? So I wanted to take a minute to just sort of address that in a blanket way. And you know, in, in other videos, maybe I'll get more specific about other stuff, but this might answer the question that you're really asking. For example, what does it mean to be a true Christian? I might answer that with another question. What does it mean to be on a diet? I mean, really think about it with me. There's a lot of different kinds of diets, right? Uh, there's, you know, there's keto and there's paleo and there's vegetarian and there's the Cambridge diet and there's the this and that and the other. I only eat steamed grape leaves, whatever it is. It doesn't matter. There's a lot of different kinds of diets, right? And there's a lot of different reasons to get on a diet. Some people want to lose weight because they want to look better for swimsuit season or whatever. Some people do it because their doctor said if you don't lose weight and get on a diet, you're going to be in a lot of trouble. You're going to have to get on these kind of meds. Some people diet for religious reasons. Some people diet for ethical reasons. Some people diet for environmental reasons. Sometimes the Venn diagram overlaps and they have a number of different reasons. Are any of them wrong? Even if your motivation for doing it is different than theirs, even if your modality, you're super into veganism and they're super not, are they wrong? Now you get what I'm trying to say, right? One of the things I can tell you for sure is you're not gonna lose any weight or meet whatever goal that is if you spend all your time worrying about the fact that somebody else is doing it wrong. Your diet is about your diet. And in fact, let's really get into that. I think it's a great uh, metaphor because one of the things I've said before, I said it in one of my books, I've said it in a couple of places, is that on a certain level, every diet works a little bit. And you know that because if you're like me, you've been on a few diets throughout the course of your life. And at the beginning of the diet, it tends to work okay. And there's lots of reasons for that. But the deep reason is Every diet works a little bit because you're starting to pay attention to what goes in your mouth. You're conscious. And so what I'm trying to say is maybe worry a little less about whether or not other people are doing diet right because on a certain level, they all work a little bit. On a certain level, they will get you to a place where you recognize that your consciousness, the ability to pay attention, the ability to, to decide that you're worth dieting, for example, will get you to a level of receptivity, a level of growth. Things will happen for you. Worry a little bit less about whether or not other people are right or doing it right and start worrying about what you got going to the degree that you start finding your center, your truth, and, and follow that with some love and some hope and some passion, you'll get better. You wanna make a convert to your diet? <laughs> you know what I mean. Live it, and people will see it and be inspired by that, or they won't. But that's between them and their nutritional, spiritual, philosophical, political goals. Get what I'm saying? So that's the answer. Who's right? Everybody's right. Get over it. You got this. Thanks for asking the questions. Keep them coming and you can do that by posting an Instagram or a tweet with the hashtag AskDieter. I'll be watching. You can also go to my website waypastok.com and ask the question there. And by the way, there's a lot of great things on that website. There's blog posts and there's a newsletter and more of these movies and all kinds of stuff. So check out the website. As always, please like and subscribe and above all, share these videos. It means a lot. Thanks a lot.